Hello guys, welcome to this channel and today I'm going to show you a tutorial and the idea of making this tutorial it is based on the questions that I find out from our friend Hafsa Khan and she was asking about how to give text how to give my text this look in Canva I want to make logo for my brand alright so uh, actually I mentioned in here yes this one can be task this test can be completed by utilizing all the tools in Canva but it takes some time to design it with layers so I did mine already here and so and this is the final one and this is all the steps that I made in here and actually all the first step second and third and fourth is just um, it's easy to make this one you can um, you can make it and um, was that a text effect in here but only these things that need to uh, let you know how to make this one so that you can change and become and uh, this font become transparent and then you can change the background so before I continue I would like to uh, introduce myself my name is Sir Sarma I come from Indonesia and I live in Bali guys if you are not yet have a comfort pro account I suggest you to click this link over here because I was affiliated with Canva, so if you click this one, it's a big help for me, so that I will get some tokens from Canva. If you are already Canva Pro account, you don't have to do it, you just keep watching, that's fair enough, alright? So now, so this is um, the case in here, and uh, this is the final one that I did here, Snap. Yeah, I don't get a similar font, but I just like to create like this. So if we can uh, create the font um, like this, so in Canva, yes, we can do it. And uh, yeah, this is another options variations that I made as well. And uh, yes, again, that's another variations that I made. Yeah, the final one that I did and uh, with um, some elements around in here. All right, and uh, I promise you that I would like to let you know. And this is all the. This is all the steps that I made in here and I believe that the first step and second and third and fourth it's uh, easier because you can de do this one in the element so this is all the settings in here and um, before I go there to the steps I would like to let you know this is uh, the element in here that I that assist me over here and I would like to let you know the information is this is golden background glowing right as you can see I would like to highlight for you guys this is golden background glowing so uh, that this is the element that I use here and I put uh, behind as a background of this font and how do I make this one I will let you know after this and uh, yes the hardest um, making only this one the fifth step and the rest of it is just easier so uh, before we go to here so and I would like to let you know the first step first so the first step and uh, the the font that I use here is archetype yeah this is the name of the font is uh, archetype Bayer and um, and I click the effect and I chose uh, neon so I just put like that okay so it's up to you if you're going to use this neon but I use it so that uh, the background like this and the second step is uh, if you are going to copy the step so I give uh, shadow the first shadow uh, not so hard it's blur and this is all the setting of set 19 Direction minus 51 and blur 22 and transparency is 46. So that's a uh, uh, I gave I attach a Shadow for this uh, second step and the third step again. I use shadow but with a different setting so offset is 42 and directions uh, minus 54 and blur is 42 and transparency is 62 so that's what I use in here and uh, steps number four the fourth one is in fact I'm going to let you know uh, the settings in here is uh, six 
the offset is 6 and the value and directions that uh, the value is uh, 117 and blur I give value 2 and transparency 100 so that to get effect white here on the on the site and the hardest one is this one okay how to make uh, this transparency and to change the background Canva doesn't have a tools how to um, remove the foreground the front ground yeah the foreground only background uh, Canva has um, uh, tools to remove that one so to remove this foreground become uh, transparent like this okay to become like this so we need to use the assistant of this blob and this uh, font yeah blob behind of this font and after that the blob must be the color must be filled with um, this gray color the hex code with the hex code seven seven three seven three seven three so that's the hex code of this uh, gray in order to get this transparent background like this like an over like i have here okay so that's why i can um get this transparent okay and how to do this one and uh, all you can do is after get this one this block this i get from this here element is just type blob and then uh, see all and you can get this one here or any yeah any kind and you can change the color become gray okay change the color and after that attach this uh, font arch archetype on the top as a first layer and after that you can group it and uh, download it and download as PNG and transparent uh, background and choose uh, recent current page and after that done and you can download it because I did mine already here so I just would like to uh, grab this one yeah I try and uh, it is working only for this okay uh, I will just upload here the one that we downloaded and there you go we just wait and I will just put aside this one because this is not original one okay because this one you can still you can uh, remove it from here and this one is um, permanently they merge each other so just click this image the the, the things that you upload and click edit image and then the background remover after that and you can see that uh, the font become transparent let's check if you have a good connection it will give you a uh, right away so uh, now we got a transparent background and apply one time and after that and uh, this background over here as I mentioned before it's a golden background glowing I will get this one and I will just put behind I will attach and put behind as a second layer at the back so it's up to you guys if you want to modificate and if you want to uh, it's up to you and any kind of uh, background that you want to use for example maybe you're going to use the gold anything that you want to use you can put it and firstly you need to remove the background and after that you can apply this and attach behind it yes as you like so this is uh, the trick how to get this um, this font transparent as you can see here okay how to get these things transparent now after we got these old things and after that we need all we're gonna do is now we need to um, to make it uh, this to, to download it this font become like this okay so what we're gonna do is um, here change this color okay change this color become become white 
so all you're going to do is edit image and go to um, go to do a tone uh, you just click randomly and don't worry about color changing you just click one more time and all the way and not all the way back you just change the color become white yeah so this is the perfect of changing the color become white and after that you can bring it, uh, you can change uh, after changing this one, after you put behind it now you can change the background, become white and then so that the all things become white now I will just put aside and after that download back again and uh, remember no transparent background and you just click uh, check at uh, the current page okay and after that download back again and after that bring it back again after download it now I'm going to check yes there you go it's coming here and I will just put on the different page so that we can see the difference and now edit image and uh, background remover so that we can remove the background so we can see the result that it will give us a font with uh, filling by uh, this uh, colorful yeah over here okay so we got here so that's that's the source and that's the way and that's the trick how I get this font filling with this uh, such color like you've seen on this uh, on this uh, screen so guys I'm done and you can attach and uh, on your um, on your uh, design and if you follow these steps in here this is the first one okay and the second one yeah uh, you can attach put yeah behind okay and if you follow this you will see the result something like this okay so this is all the result that i have in here all right there you go so the first one and the second one and the third one and the fourth one so guys it is done and i'm done and i hope this one it's not so difficult and uh, I challenge myself to make this one for you guys just to help just to help you and to help others as well for those who are not yet familiar how to make this kind of design similar in Canva so it's easy if you follow the steps in here one more time thank you guys for watching this tutorial and um, if you think this tutorial is, is useful for you guys you can uh, Subscribe to support this channel, but if you don't like to get any notifications, you don't have to do it. You just keep watching. That's fair enough. And see you again for the next tutorial. Bye-bye.